Welcome to a video from the digitallifestyle.com. In this video I'm going to show you how you can use the Microsoft Mail app that's built into Windows 10 to get your Gmail. So you don't have to use the browser, you can just use the Mail app, which I've got pinned down here, but you'll also find it on the Start menu, or you can just type in Search and you'll get the Mail app there. So to do this, all you need to do is know your Gmail username and password, and you can get set up. So I'm going to open the app. So it opens with uh, my existing account and now I'm going to add Gmail so I can do, I can go to settings, manage accounts, add an account. Now you can choose your um, mailbox type. So I'm going to use Gmail, so I'm going to use Google. So ask the email account I want to sign with, with, so I use my Gmail account. It asks me for my password. Now, because um, I've set up two-factor authentication on uh, my Gmail account, which means I can't just enter a username and password. I've got to confirm it really is me. And I use a, uh, the Authenticator app, or in this case, I'm going to use a verification text message. I prefer the Authenticator app, but for this test account, I've just used the text code. So I'm going to send that. So I've received that code. So enter that in. As I said normally I use the Authenticator app, but I'll show you that perhaps in a separate video. And I'm done. This is my test account. So you can see I'm getting a lot. Of alerts there about my security because I've just signed in but as you can see it's um, it's all connected and I've got my emails in there it also syncs your calendar uh, between your gmail calendar and in this app as well so you can fire up your calendar and you've got your uh, email app uh, your, your gmail calendar in there as well so that's it it's as simple as that easy to get gmail straight into the mail app it works offline, it caches things offline, so when you're offline you can still access your email and your calendar and syncs back up when you're back online again. Very simple, works really well. So that's a quick tip on how to connect Gmail to Windows 10 Mail app. 